Hey guys, WaffleBox87 here, and we are now in the final episode of Paper Mario. How do you like the montage that I just put out? I thought it was pretty interesting. But anyway, here we go. Proceeding onward to the final showdown. Spin dashing upstairs, as usual. Also, this is way too loud. Let me try and turn it down a little bit. That's a little bit better. I want to be able to hear it, but not so that it overshadows me. That'd be bad. Because I want to be heard. ha! <laughs> Welcome to your nightmare! You should thank me, Mario! Since you've been my rival for so long, I've arranged a special arena for your defeat! And then he destroys the bridge. Okay, then. Alright. Like it? You're completely trapped. How does it feel, huh? Mario, be careful! You fell right into a trap and you call yourself a hero! Did you think we're forced to have to sit back and watch as you save the star spirits? Put together another surprise for your device that gives us powers as power! King Bowser will be so powerful, the way the power of the star spirits can compare! And they'll join me invincible thanks to my wisdom! Are you ready, my king? Power up! Well, he's definitely powered up. He's glowing. He's glowing with blue. Am I ready to fight, though? I'm missing a few bit of stats. Okay, then. Like, that could be bad. I'm pretty sure I can't paralyze him at all. But I feel like it's important that I title him, just because. I, I can afford to waste a turn. I have no feeling arms. It's the Evil King Bowser. Uh, I think you got bigger. That's not a good sign. Max HP 99. Defense power 2. He has a huge arsenal attack and blowing clouds of fire and jumping on us. Fire attack 10. Stamp and nail attack 8. I'm sure he has other attacks I don't know, but can't kill his mysterious device to summon Beatrice's power even more! That's hardly even fair. You should use the star beam whenever you use the star to increase his power. Oh, you already knew that. Okay. That's a good use of a turn. <laughs> I'm gonna supercharge my jump. Even though I'm pretty sure he's spiky. Aha! You can't start trying it. Is he spiky? Probably. Nope! Alright, 15 damage one turn, not bad. Let's switch out to Watt now, because... Electrodash. And... Zap! There, there's... Some of the damage. Good old Star Rot, huh? He does that. So now we do this. Also, is it just me or is this a lot louder or am I a lot quieter or something? Donk! Nothing happened. Oh no, brave Mario! What did I do? The way this thing was going battle was a little short to defeat him. Somebody, please help Mario. I have a guzzler in your half, keep quiet! Bonk! A cutscene is happening in the middle of a battle. This is a very... What is it with Nintendo RPGs and having, like, the power of friendship? Or, kind of. And... Nothing happened. That was useless. So now we, now we just use focus. And we drop a block. Ow. Now we can actually start doing damage, because we're powered up. I can't use Z to switch. Okay, then. Uh. 
Now he's only gonna take two damage from this fallen block. Bonk! Yeah, I can't use Z to switch. Okay. I suppose it would break things if I could focus before my attack. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And another block? Another block. Bonk! And now we take him one damage. So increasing Twink's attack and defense. This block should do absolutely no damage. Bonk! It, it can't be! My attacks don't work! Uh, oh no! Now I remember, the stars got all the power from ordering people's wishes. Peach's wishes to give it all star kid power. So now we dash into our deal full damage and end the fight. Oh, King Bowser, I have failed you! Oh yes, we did, Twink, now I must save Mario, but what can I do? I know, Prince Speech, make a wish, just like it did for me, make a wish to have more power to the Star Spirits. Thank you, the Mushroom Kingdom, Star Haven, Mario, make a wish to the stars, thank you to all those things. You wish to star if or to the Star Spirits and give them strength. Okay, Twink, I'll try. I'll go help Mario. <laughs> Broom is still floating. What's the matter, Mario? Feeling a bit under the weather? You have to work out more. Bonk! <laughs> oh my, I feel power flooding into me. Honorable Star Spirits, I'll do what I can to help. Twink! What a surprise! I feel the wishes of Princess Peach and all the Mushroom Kingdom giving us power. Perhaps now we can match Bowser's strength. Now, Mario, don't give up. Everyone is behind you. Receive your power and do your very best. Power up the Star Beam! Star Beam is an upgrade, it's now Peach Beam. Or I can use Peach Beam. Hey, our, he our health is back. And he's still missing a quarter of his. Okay, now I can Peach Beam away his Star Rod power. Because now Twink is there. I feel like I should triple charge. Oh, I missed a turn. Whatever. Ow! That did 11 damage. Excuse me. Now let's supercharge my jump. And then Electro Dash into him. And now I'm poisoned. Oh, right. Okay, then. Let's refresh. Refresca, or something, I don't know. Still useful even now. That's power I got at the very beginning of the game, pretty much. More Electro Dash. Ha! He didn't kick away one of my commands, which means I can boosted power bounce. For a whopping 30 damage. Cool. Now he has defense, so well, he has a defense of two, right? So Bo won't be able to do anything at all. So yeah, lots well, the best option. This battle's not over yet. Oh boy. Okay. In that case, we'll see one of these things. Useless happy flower. Zap. He can heal himself, by the way. Let's do 
some more supercharged. Why? What is that supposed to do? Marie! Are you kidding me right now? What was the point of that? Oh! He stripped away my charge. How dare you? Feel the power of Quake Stomp. Well, Watt just sits there with her eyes going all wibbly. Oh. Okay, then. Well, that's not very helpful. How is it? Let's do one of these, I guess. No, that's not worth it. Let's power bounce him. That's what, 11 damage? Okay. And now he's gonna make himself invulnerable again. He can only heal himself three times, I believe. There we are. Watt's back. Ha! I blocked Watt! But I didn't block Mario. Which means now I can do this, because he can't use the same attack twice in a row, I believe. Get my charge back. Ah, oh, man, I missed a hit. Whatever. Ow. I can live one more hit. That's fine. And let's supercharge power bounce. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Bomp! That has a 21 health. Hey, I blocked the hit! So now let's do some smooth air. Electro Dash for five. And heal. Okay. Okay, how much health is he at now? 46. Alright. I can deal. All my power is still increased. I'll quick stop. Good enough. Wait, quick but Quick stop can cap? Really? I didn't actually realize that until now. And you can tell it's a cap because it will throw me off from being able to do it even though I didn't run out of time to do it, if that makes any sense. Like, it all or nothing didn't fail. But I still didn't land a hit, if that makes any sense. He only has 16 health left. Which means, unless he heals this turn. He's done. Because, you see, I can do 11 damage with power bounce. I play it. That's the fight! Right there! Oh no! Mario defeated me again! It was a victory! This time I became Vince Moss still couldn't beat him! Darn it! Oh, no star points. I thought I was gonna get one more level up. Oh well, whatever. <laughs> Mario got the star rod!
now the platform exploding. Yo, Kami Koopa, it's all the shake. Uh, your kingship, the battle of Mars is so intense, my device for increasing your power seems to start not functioning. It's entirely screwed up and its power appears to be heading back into your castle. Hey, right, to tell you this, but both the castle and this spot right here are about to explode. You must flee the evil king, we have no choice. Alright, what? Are you really? That 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 that's a big problem. What's gotta hear, right? Huh? <laughs> the explosion graphics are so low quality. It's amazing. I could make the ending a separate video, but no, whatever. Why would I do that? We're already here. And now we all slowly float down back to the Mushroom Kingdom. Or, you know, back to the castle, that works too. You did it! You brought back a precious star rod! I thank you from the bottom of my heart! We will use it to bring peace back to this world. Now I'll be able to grant everyone's wishes again. All of this is thanks to you, Mario. When you look at the night sky, you'll know that the glittering stars are praising you for your courage. Look upon their bright light and remember our thanks. You really took it to Bowser, Mario! Really saw it too! What an impressive strength! I knew you could do it! Mario, don't think we don't know how hard you worked for all of us. It must have been difficult. We won't forget your efforts. I hope Bowser learned something from this. Maybe he'll behave himself now. Although, I'd say the chances of that are pretty slim. <laughs> oh well. No words can express completely how thankful we are for all that you've done. Hope is returned both to Star Haven and to all the Mushroom Kingdom, where in your debt, Mario. And Twink, may I say, you really rose to the occasion. You've proven yourself to be a grown up star. Heh, <laughs> I'll go on. Well, I think it's time we return to Star Haven. All the stars there are waiting for us, no doubt. It's time to say goodbye now, Mario. May the stars forever shine brightly upon you. Super Mario Galaxy foreshadow and go! <laughs> Not really. I mean, may the stars shine brightly upon you for all time or something like that. That was said in the ending of Super Mario Galaxy, wasn't it? Mario, I'd like to thank you too. And Princess Peach, it was an honor to help you in a time of need. I hope maybe to see you again sometime. But I'm going to become a respectable star and make people's wishes come true. Thank you so much for helping me, Twink. You've always been a stellar friend to me. <laughs> okay then. Princess Peach, I. Well, no, never mind. I have to go too. Thank you very much, Mario. I also maybe Princess Peach. Goodbye. And it turns out that Twink is just like Polari's cousin or something, from as in the black limit that Rosalina always has in Galaxy. So now we float downward once more. Right wing. Oh, so that's it, huh? That's how you took the star ride back from Bowser. It seems like another wild adventures in the books, bro. The castle's back in its normal place, everyone's returned home safely. You came through in the end, just like you always do. I know you've been back for days now, but I still bet you'll kind of feel like, feel like an adventure, don't you? Mm-hmm. That reminds me, the palace who traveled with you. I wonder what they're up to now. Go, reverse montage! This episode's ending as it began with a montage. It's <laughs> pretty good. Goombadio! Hi, Barricary. I thought you were back at work delivering letters. <laughs> I sure am. This is an essential cloud draft from Jacob Letter to Goombadio's from Princess Page. <laughs> <laughs> so what does it say? Also, how is he holding out? Hang on, Gumburia. Jeepers! This is an invitation to a party at the castle! This is a princess is having a party, I'm invited to have fun! I hope she made lots of spaghetti! Okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> Except this isn't a picnic. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Koopa Village. <laughs> hey, it's, I think, Colorado's wife. And Bootler. Uh-huh. 
Wait, the shy guys are invited too? Hey, look, the pub bulb's still there. <laughs> You're mad on guns! <laughs> I don't know. This game, it just has so much personality, it's definitely my favorite Mario series RPG. Second place being Bowser's Design Story, because it's the only one I actually own. But now that Dolphin 5.0 is released, and we can finally actually emulate Wii and GameCube games smoothly, I might actually be able to do a Thousand Year Door series after this. That'd be pretty cool. It would make sense, especially if I could then do Super Paper Mario. And also, once Citra, the 3DS emulator, gets into a good set, a good set where I can actually like play commercial 3DS games properly, I might be able to even do a Sticker Star series after that. Even though I know people hate that game, but Sticker Star is actually my favorite Paper Mario app besides this one. It's not my favorite Mario RPG, because it's not it's barely an RPG at all. There's no leveling system besides the HP parts. Hey, letter. This this whole series is ending as it began with a party at Peach's Castle. He uses the same music in the intro! Did I just do the abandoned Luigi glitch? I did. I have actual control! I can spin! Chuck Wismo! Oh. <laughs> oh, I'll miss him just randomly showing up at the worst moments. Like, during the penguin murder story. Hey, bad shop. Hey, Koopa Koop. Oh. Hi, Minty and Associated Bubbles. Can I go in the flower fields door? No, I can't. Okay, then. This game, it just has so much personality to it, and, I, and the music's so good, too, most of the time. Also, it was, like, the second game to use action commands, which is basically, like, doing special things during an attack to make them stronger. The first being, of course, Super Mario RPG. Another game that does that a lot is Mother 3, and I hope to continue that series. But man... There's just so many memories that come off this game. Also, yes, this video is going to be very long, because I have to get the whole ending in it. Or, you know, cut, but why would I do that? Also, by the way, if you were just here to watch the final battle, I'm fine with that. I only showed off one glitch during the uh, two glitches during this whole series. That's a, a record low for me. Hey, we'll be just reading the thread. Which I'll speed up, because otherwise this will take like five hours. <laughs> hey, they're running the starship. Hey, Chuck Wismo gun. <laughs> he has fireworks in his hat. Oh, hey, look, it's the Bowser float thing that was in the boss battle. And now it's getting blown up. Or at least the Koopa Bros are. <laughs> it's the whale. It's the bad shop, guys. And then Tutankoopa. Koopa. Yeah, speeding up this is actually very much affecting the timing of the music. 
considering this is supposed to be the Cooper Bros part. But I don't care. Hey, flying double blah blah. Oh, he's being held up by booze, and his heart is waving. Hey, look, it's the Goomba King is stuck on a tree. Is this the, that's the, supposed to be the Tony Cooper part? Hey, look, it's the Yoshis. And Raphael the Raven was in there, and there he is again. And there he is again. And there he is again. And there's Lava Prana. And there's Raphael. There's Lava Prana. And there's Lava Prana. And there he's one last time. <laughs> and then the Yoshi kid flies off. And they all and they all run towards Huff and Puff and try to eat him, right? Oh, no, that's Gourmet Guy, never mind. Haha, <laughs> it's a reference to Glana Candy from Yoshi's story. Even though it was probably after this game, but hey, well, Crystal King. Two Crystal Kings, except one's Duple Ghost. And it's the third one. Except the second one is also Duple Ghost. And the Crystal Bits just carry them away. Hey, look, it's Junior Troopa, having a magical battle against Kame. That's pretty cool. <laughs> juggling hammers! It's almost as dangerous as juggling chainsaws. And Junior Troopa again. Except now Bowser's getting attacked, so it's funny. Pretty good. Oh, there's more? Well, now they're Christmas ornaments. Hey, <laughs> look, skating penguins! Hey, look, not skating penguins. Hey, look, it's the people from Club 64. And Chanterelle. And Amazing Daisies, yes! And then all of the magical people, including the ghost one. And in the sun, and here's what's supposed to be Chanterelle singing. What is the Super Mario Club anyway? Is this general guy coming in? Yeah, there he is. The Hey Hose, aka what shy guys are called in Japan. This video is like already 31 minutes long at this point, pretty much. Actually, no, it's what, like 30, 45? How are those toads glowing? I didn't know they could do that. And then you just have Mario and Peach on like the mushroom cruiser or whatever it's called. And then Twink. More glowing toads. And then fireworks. That's right, everyone. The end of not just an episode, but a series. But due to uh, things going on in my house involving construction, a new series won't start for a little while, I'll say. So, I'll be waiting expectantly for it, just as like it, just like you are. It'll probably be Thousand Year Door, though. Actually, no. I'll continue Mother 3 before I do that. And then I'll do something with... I'm not continuing Cave Story or Metro Norman World before anyone asks about those. I'm also never going to continue Undertale. Just because my most viewed video is about it doesn't mean it's actually something I care about. This music's pretty good, though. It's very calming. Sadly, unlike in Super Mario RPG, there's no way to influence what types of fireworks show up here. Where in that game, if you buy fireworks, you can then... The more you buy, the more stuff you get here, and you need to buy some to get to the super to, to fight the Super Boss cool QX because the shiny stone gets traded for firework, doesn't it? See you guys next time, if there is a next time.